So hi Eric. Um, so I'm gonna teach you how to uh, train your Excel to do some uh, actions, right? Um, so if you can see my screen, um, these are I have listed here um, list of uh, my action that I need to automate. So I, my first step is to open calculator, type in ten thousand, then uh, minus then 3,500 then pressing equal sign copying that answer which is 65 and then um, close the calculator by pressing alt F4 switch back to uh, this workbook uh, current workbook that I'm that is open and then um, paste the value to this Excel so I'm um, going to press Alt F4 and then I'm going to create a new module. So my module, I'm going to name this one as um, Sub Calculator. So my first uh, action would be Open Calculator. So I'm going to type in some code on actually i did this already so i'm gonna copy it notepad okay um first step is open calculator so i'm going to write a comment open calculator so here shell the calc.exe and then bv normal focus it's like uh pressing run command and then typing calc that exit so that's it that's uh, what this code uh, does and then um, I'm going to uh, type in uh, 10,000 so I'm gonna use the application that sent keys um, Type in ten thousand. By the way, um, these are the uh code combination. Um, if you want to uh do some actions or pressing this kind of button, you need to um uh, type in the syntax. So if I want to press enter, I need to write this one enter on this um inside this two quotation mark. So okay, I'm gonna. Uh, type 10,000 and then I'm just going to copy this line and then type in uh, minus then I'm gonna deduct 3, 5 and then type in equal sign pressing equal sign and then I'm going to copy uh, the result so I need to press Control C. So I'm gonna copy this line and then I'm gonna Control C. So I have here prefix when we want to um, press a key before uh, this letter. So I want to press Control. So I need to add a prefix of caret in front of my uh, key combination here. So I need to add a caret and then close open a bracket, a curly brace, and then C. So it means copy, control C. Then after copying, um, I want to um, close that uh, calculator. So I need um wait i need to switch okay i'm going to type in app activate so this means switch back to excel make sure that the name here matches uh your uh current workbook here so it will open uh, the same workbook. 
and then um, I'm gonna paste control I'm gonna press control V so it will copy to my Excel so I'm just go ahead copy this line and then control victory there um, uh, one more thing I forgot to switch to my calculator so I need to add um, app activate here there uh, this means uh, switch switch to uh, calculator because this line is just invoking that calculator so we need to switch to that uh, application so oh one more thing I need to add some delays because sometimes um, it result into some errors so we need to give time or allowance for our computer to um, read or to do some certain actions so before ap after invoking a calculator let's say I need to put some delay like this one so the first zero is hour second is minute the last one is uh, represents uh, seconds so I'm gonna add some comment here add delay okay so we need four seconds here so maybe I need to also add some delay on after closing the well actually I don't have the close uh, close um, calculator here so this uh, delay here I forgot to close my calculator so application that send keys I'm gonna press alt f4 so f4 is this line really braces uh, f15 I mean f4 and I need to press alt before the f4 so alt is uh, percent percent so need to add percent here okay so I'm gonna read uh, my code again first is um, open calculator and then add some delay delay wait four seconds and then um, switch to calculator and then type in 10,000 type, uh, type in minus uh, 35 um, equal sign and then application send keys um, it's it means copy control C and then after copy uh, I will press alt plus f4 means closing it close close calculator and then adding some delay again uh, so my PC will respond uh, um, after uh, closing the application and then um, switch back to Excel um, and then um, typing or pressing control V or paste so I think we can run this now so um, let me add a shortcut to that macro right click assign macro calculator okay so okay so let's see I'm gonna press run macro opening calculator oh it's so fast I didn't add some delay so you can see uh, what uh, the tool types in the calculator so you can see that uh, I have the correct answer because uh, 10,000 minus 35 is um, 65, 6,500. So uh, for you to see that, I'm going to add some delay here. So maybe after typing in, um, after copying, maybe I'm going to add some 5 seconds maybe. 5 seconds before closing it. Let's do this again. I'm gonna delete this one. 
Oh, let's change the value. How about four five? So I will get five five hundred. Run. Opening. Wait four seconds. Typing in five five and then switch back to Excel and then copy paste. There you go. So so it works. Uh, yeah, I guess that's for now. Um, I'm going to stop my screen recording.